All right, here's the beginning of my gas line dig. I was told uh, 100 feet, the first 100 feet belongs to National Grid. They're, they'll take care of that, and then I have to take care of the rest. So starting here, I, I drove a stake to there and ran a string line. And then I take the inverted paint and paint it yellow so I got a guide to go straight. And then another stake, three feet to the house parallel straight back and they want three feet away from things like this in my hose bib so that puts me about three and a half feet actually in between the two either way so i got my three foot three foot and so here i go two feet deep one foot wide 140 cubic feet of feet uh, cubic feet of dirt translates to and stone translate to a little over five cubic yards of whatever that I got to move today uh, temperatures around 45 it ain't gonna get no better it's just gonna get worse I just hope they get this laid this year so that I can cover this back in because I don't want to have a open trench here all winter long if I can help it then I have to bring the snowblower out across that which I could do with a board or something but I'd rather not have that and just get it all done and if I'm lucky three feet parallel to this line right up here I'll come down and then the guy is gonna hopefully run his sewer line down through the woods where I've trenched down and then through there with a ditch witch to cut the roots a few years back when I laid my electric line boom on that side anyway that's what i'm doing today sunday day off work yesterday so i'm gonna try to dig this i don't know how successful i'll be hopefully it's just mostly sand in this top layer of stone i anticipate getting into some roots because i had some right in here that i had to cut through to get to the uh go down and put the foam in this stone down and i remember that same route when i was doing the footer for the house for the monolithic that I had to get through. So more than likely I'm gonna have more of it this way. Just get at it again with the Sawzall and uh, chainsaw if I had to. But anyway, that's my day. Fun, fun, fun.